Hey folks, uh, happy to get back to you with another video. Today's video is going to be an unboxing video on a high frequency Tesla coil or a Tesla candle. Now here's one that I made some time back using a single transistor and this thing worked awesomely. This is basically a ceramic. This is actually made of aluminum oxide or bauxite. So I just recently was on AliExpress and I found a high frequency Tesla coil or Tesla candle that runs at 16 megahertz, which is even higher than that one, which runs at 10 megahertz. So I'm gonna unbox it today and let's see what we got. So they claim that they provide a fully constructed unit the only thing you need to put on it is the breakout point. It comes with a, a tungsten breakout point right here. And I'm guessing you just take this breakout point, you coil over the wire like this, and you just place this on top like this so it's, it fits inside the breakout. So here's the whole coil. Let me just show it to you. So it's got like a, an L3 coil, which is the resonator. It's got an L2 coil, which is that. And it's got a single transistor with a heat sink. And it's got a high power fan, which blows on this small heat sink. And it also looks like it comes with its own power supply. So it's got a switching power supply that's rated for 220 volts or 110 volts. So the output is 48 volts at five amps which is basically 240 watts. The coil itself actually has a plug for music. So we're gonna turn on the coil. There you go. And there's your Tesla candle. Let's turn off the lights so you can see it better. And let's get a fluorescent tube. You can see it's lighting up these tubes. Okay, folks, the next part of this experiment is to see if we can melt, melt tungsten with this candle. So I don't know if this is gonna work or not, but I know it's gonna get real bright. And there's a lot of UV light that comes from that flame. So hence the uh, welding glasses. Okay, time to turn it on. Flame. Let's see what happens. Wow, that is bright. That is so bright. Looks like it's melting it. Let's see if we can ignite the gases in the plasma globe. Whoa. I don't want to burn a, a hole through the glass. There you go. Pretty interesting. Just melting some steel with it. Thanks for watching this quick demo. One of the advantages of this particular unit, which only cost about 60 to $65, is that it can be run for a long time because of, it, because of the uh, effective uh, heat sink and big fan. The smaller, more cheaper units um, can only be run for a few seconds at a time. And often the transistor, which is only using a single transistor to handle all that power, that will often fail due to overheating. But in this case, it stays cool enough to keep this thing running. That was the main advantage of this. And it also comes with a sturdy construction and a quartz secondary coil former. So that's it. So there you go, unboxing and setting up a simple high frequency Tesla coil. Thanks for watching folks and please don't forget to check out more of my videos.